So this is the first um, video from the second lockdown that's happening here in Berlin. And I want to dedicate this video to this very lockdown. As I feel there are so many responses and navigations with the situation of lockdown, where for example I have to cancel live seminars, etc where I do respond differently than the last time. During the first lockdown, I was very much in, oh my God, I'm frozen, I can't move at all. And now I feel more empowerment and inner options, a variety of options in how to handle the situation. So I feel a range, uh, um, a, a range of choices amongst the situation. And I do not feel that much as a victim that I feel, um, which was how I referred basically to the first lockdown happening. So coming from this personal experience, still a lockdown is a super interesting global and individual constellation, as I truly think all of us know if they are now sitting in lockdown or not, if you are sitting now in a lockdown or not due to Corona. Um, it's super interesting because almost all of us can refer to some level or experience of I feel restricted by the outer circumstances. For example, I feel restricted by uh, social distancing or I feel restricted by wearing a mask or I feel restricted by others are not wearing the mask and they should do and others are putting me into danger by not um, staying with the distance of social distancing, etc. So that's super interesting. All of us coming from so many different angles on how this COVID topic hits my personal life can refer to I feel restricted, I feel limited by the outer circumstances. And yes, I do want the situation to be over. I want us to storm freely without any danger around infection etc back into the outer world of course having a nightlife dancing without fear of infection of putting me or others into danger etc and still there is something so valuable that i can learn that you can learn that all of us can deepen our learning in that is so accessible in a lockdown and that is that my sense if i'm restricted or not my sense if i'm limited or not is only written in my own nervous system there are never outer circumstances that truly 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 force me to feel less free then I am free anyway, which is 100% freedom, no matter what. And that's so beautiful because as an embodiment teacher and doing so much, so much research around life force and aliveness and what makes people experience happiness, experience freedom, it never can be boiled down to outer circumstances have to change. Otherwise, I cannot access freedom, I cannot access bliss, I cannot access ecstasy. It's never ever truly true if I dig deep enough, deeply enough. Um, so my uh, research went into, can I squeeze the juice of freedom out of this lockdown situation before it's over? Because once the lockdown is over, my inner perception or experience that my sense of freedom, happiness, energy, etc. depends on outer circumstances, this inner conditioning won't be gone. It might be just less be accessible and therefore it might take more effort from my side in order to be transformed then. So what a beautiful gift, this lockdown situation. What an opportunity. What another opportunity for growth and change. And I, I could say I can explain why a nervous system defines completely on its own in the inner world. 
if one experiences happiness and freedom or not. But I do not want to explain it. I want us to be practical explorers. I want us to test the methods in order to get, does it work? Because if it works, let's say it's true for now, not because I'm saying it or you are saying it, just because it works for now in terms of happiness, freedom and energy level. And if you test it and it doesn't work, um, don't believe anything. Don't believe my scientific research. Don't believe the other party. Just believe what works for you in terms of alive aliveness, happiness, energy level and the sense of inner freedom no matter what. So what I did from there is jumping with my own tools into this lockdown situation and I want you to do the same. Because I think the more we are practical explorers and the more practical explorers that are around here, um, the better the better the field of research. So I created from there um, an audio track, an audio journey that you can download in the show notes below this video, uh, shaking up the power of lockdown. And you will be guided through it. So for now, I do not have to say anything about that besides have a safe space, comfortable clothing, a space where you are undisturbed for something like 20 minutes and no this is not a therapy it's a somatic exploration that you are doing as a self-responsible explorer and if you want to do that you are so welcome to do that and you are so welcome to comment below this video how this works for you if this works for you what's your sense before and after this shaking journey and another beautiful thing that we can do as long as being online is okay <laughs> and it is during the lockdown and I'm so grateful for that. You can share this audio journey. You can share it with just please everybody who might benefit from another curious, hungry, self-responsible exploration around happiness and freedom.